in life one dreams but very few people are lucky their dreams come true during their lifetime i had a dream that one day a genomics will be done in this country across from himalaya to kanyakumari i had a dream that this genomics knowledge will benefit to create new affordable healthcare system i'm so glad a journey that began nearly 20 years ago has now fructified we have over hundreds of small genomics company we have several institutions which are dedicated to genomics and my coming to delhi to build an institute of genomics and integrative biology where knowledge will be generated that will benefit the healthcare system was a true dream today when i read this book i feel very proud not only the technology has been developed to do human exome genome sequencing and its analysis but it has been beautifully illustrated by vinod skaria and sridha subbu two young people they had no prior training in these areas of genome sequencing and computational analysis they not only established with my encouragement this extensively beautiful facility and capability indigeniously involving dozens and dozens of students but this is an ultimate a book for the doctors i see a future where exome genome sequencing will be a part of our clinical investigation just like cat today a cat scan analysis though expensive has become a part of our routine with the drop of the cost for genome sequencing a million times last 15 years i'm sure it will be so affordable maybe a thousand dollar even below that maybe 30000 rupees 25000 rupees who knows it can be even 20000 rupees exome sequencing can be done even cheaper maybe 10000 rupees which would be even cheaper than a standard scat scan done in a private company i believe this book will not only teach the doctors what you need to do and what you need not to what is the best part of the book is the small boxes did you know and each did you know are so fantastic for people who are beginner and is also clearly explains in simple terms what is a pedigree chart what is a disease particularly inheritable and how do you go about what is the advantage of whole exome sequencing in clinical setting and what you should not be doing two things makes me very proud one is the formation of the guardian consortium and that's where the indian population comes to a great benefit we have large population where there are diseases still significantly present where we can out compete the west and i what i call is unfair advantage we can take because of the genetic material and diversity we have the second thing i like the story of bhai in this book and it's very beautifully put that bhai is considered to be in the in, in our bollywood movie the don but here why 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 he presents a brother a person who is part of our system who needs medical assistance this is a touching story and i'm glad that 
the IGID could join the club of whole genome sequencing in 2009, which was celebrated by the nation. I had the great privilege of being that time the director of CSIR and it was a great honor to see our honorable prime minister acknowledging in the parliament the accomplishment. These two young people were much more younger than pushing them, giving them enormous freedom and encouraging them and creating high expectation. I am so proud to say today in 2015 they are completely mature genomic scientists, understand and their complete role of genome sequencing, exome sequencing, the limitations, the boundaries and they so beautifully put it up here, they put it up here which I am sure will be a great help, the book Exome Sequencing Analysis and Interpretation and Handbook for Prediction. I wish them all best and I hope this will be there at the table of every geneticist and every clinician who wants to be in the frontier of science.